Seed Mead, the movie art of Seed Mead. This is the book for our design book review. I wanted to make uh, this review about this uh, incredible futuristic designer, Seed Mead, because a lot of you lately are asking me how can I be more creative. The best way to be more creative is uh, to make a research, of course, but also to buy or to have or to look at some particular type of books. Sid Mead was a designer, futuristic designer, an incredible visionary designer. And here you will find some of his best uh, sketches, projects, illustrations, paintings that he made when he was working uh, for the science fiction movies and for several uh, movie directors. So this book is very particular because it's not only about car design, but it's a little bit about everything. You will find a lot of uh, movies uh, for which he worked and uh, several illustrations, uh, sketches, projects he made in order to uh, let the movie you know, become reality. Here there is uh, Sid Mead on the left. Sadly, he passed away uh, a couple of years ago. I made a, a video about him uh, as a tribute. So if you are curious to know a little bit more about his career, you can go and check out the video I made uh, as a tribute to him. So Sid Mead, uh, it's somebody that uh, had an incredible talent. That's uh, really something that we don't have to forget incredible talent and an incredible creativity. In the early 80s, science fiction movies become very, start to become very popular. And he was the best candidate, you know, to work on those movies for the scenarios, environment design, the transportation and product design involved in those movies. And that's what he did. He did it in an incredible way. Awesome works, fantastic stuff. Now, this uh, book will show you a lot of his work. And one thing is very important that you have to understand and don't forget is that he was working on each project from the smallest one to the biggest one always with a very clear design process, this process that is very, very similar to what we do for production cars or production uh, products. You will find uh, works here, sketches, there are thumbnail sketches, uh, after which he would make a package design, and on top of that package he would make a nice renderings, a presentation drawings, in order to get to the final models and scale one-to-one -one scale models. Here you have a great example of what I say, because you can see this special seat sitting place, okay, for this sort of pilot. You can see that uh, the seat uh, and, and the, the whole thing is being sketched from every views, right proportions, on thinking about ergonomy, okay, and then he puts all the extra gadgets and electronics uh, and, and hardwares around it and of course all this with a, with a very good a very nice creativity he went also on to the uh, costume design you will find other illustrations and sketches that will show you how he made that so you have a, here a very good example of a, a creative approach very talented, that is really 360 degrees. You see, it goes to from architecture also to graphics. Because in movies, there are lots of these things you have to take care of. Here there are, for example, this is a wind, uh, wind technology tower. And all those things, uh, you have to think that have been made uh, about 30, 40 years ago. So it's not something of 10 or 20 years ago. Those are the classical, beautiful illustrations, paint, gouache paint that used to make uh, 
seen me then that, that uh, you can find a lot on if you google his game there are other books that will show you much more of those type of uh, illustrations renderings like sentinel for example this is another book i suggest you to buy and here you can see how he went from package to final rendering and then model because this was a model for the movies so we are in front of a complete designer okay that is able to do about everything you ask him to do here there is a typical transportation with the classical pen sketch doodles from Blade Runner you will re probably you'll uh, recognize it if you watch the movie if you didn't watch the movie I suggest you strongly to go and check it out you will like it you will love it and you will uh, realize watching the movie that uh, there was a, a very particular designer behind it behind every scene every detail this is a very nice combination between uh, modern and traditional architecture and the whole thing together becomes very uh, futuristic very interesting that uh, that uh, minivan that uh, vehicle on the right not bad and here you have uh, uh, the architecture design process so environmental design and uh, one thing that you notice is the perspective he's also always using a very very powerful one-point perspective in most of the cases or a typical two-point perspective like in those two thumbnails sketches and you can see how proportions are right and then from there he moves to the final illustration some interiors and uh, you see this is a sort of a bed and thinking about everything not not traditionally it breaks the rules and that's something that it's really interesting and that can help you a lot in inspiring you for uh, how to how can i say implement or improve your creativity or exercise your creativity it's really this design approach that is really uh, like thinking out of the box without without forgetting what is uh, uh, what we have today what was in our past you know so that's a good thing that sinmid really is able to put all those things together here some graphics some numbers and uh, you know those graphics are still today very very contemporary very very used also and uh, other illustrations always great perspective great focal point use of focal point as you can see and uh, I, I really strongly suggest you to go and buy this book because it's a, a mix of almost uh, everything and uh, it's uh, it's exactly what you need in order to have your uh, uh, stimuli right your uh, inspiration to do different things this book costs 35 dollars or 35 euros price is all very very similar so i really suggest you to buy seed mead book the movie art of seed mead now if you like this channel uh please subscribe if you like this video put your like it will help a lot and if you really like everything we did with this video if you hit the thanks button you will offer me a coffee thank you very much thank you and uh and please stay tuned because we keep on going with those design books reviews thank you